Hey there, horror fans. Filmmaker Trent Duncan here. Welcome to the epic sequel to Icons of Horror. Be sure to subscribe and share it with your friends so we can continue to make more epic horror battles. Thanks again, and I hope you enjoy. I know you're out there. Command 1, this is Bravo 5. Target is sedated, requesting immediate evac, and a cleanup crew, over. Out like a light. ETA is two minutes. Secure the girl. Got it. Whoa, whoa! Take it easy, take it easy. Put that thing down. What the hell is that thing? I know this is weird, but I really can't help you with you pointing that gun at me. <sighs> Thank God, he had me scared there for a minute. human teleportation and molecular decimation, uh, bringing a subject back from another dimension is not too easy. Uh, but the trials have all been successful. 
good. It's imperative that we bring Freddy and Jason back. I need their DNA. Uh, uh, yeah, yes, sir, I understand. We're, uh, we're working around the clock to get it done. Tell me, Dr. West, how are the subjects of the Alice Project holding up? Well, since my serum is in its beginning stages, the first two females had injuries far too severe for reanimation. What about the T-virus isolation enhancement formula? Yes, uh, well, initially we had some trouble merging the two formulas, but uh, the third female seems to be responding well to treatment, and she looks to make a full recovery with an enhanced set of skills. Good. And Michael Myers? He is alive and, and stable, but in a coma. We have yet to treat him with either of the serums. He's just too unpredictable, uncontrollable. Move to phase two of the Alice Project and prep Michael for treatment with the serum. The team has returned with the creeper. His blood work was sent to Dr. West for DNA extraction. Excellent. Soon my army of super soldiers will be complete. Created from the, the DNA of some of the world's most iconic killers. And all under my control. Very impressive. <laughs> you never cease to amaze me. Tamara, tell me, have you found my puzzle box yet? <laughs> We're trying our best, sir. Your iconic killer fishing expeditions have stretched our manpower a little thin. Excuses don't look good on you, Tamara. I give you access to all my resources. And all you can give me is excuses and lies. I have the team searching the city as we speak. It's only a matter of time. <clears throat> the contractors are barely more than glorified mall cops. We already had a team wiped out, going to retrieve a VHS tape. I need more muscle. I need the shape. What makes you think you could control him? Magic. Hello? Anybody home? Shut up and step aside. All work and no play makes Rachel a dull girl. Like I haven't heard that one before. Keep an eye out. You know, these BS search missions are a waste of time, right? Can't wait to get out of this contract unit into the real ranks of Umbrella. That's where the real action is. Don't you think so? Rachel? Are you there? Rachel? Rachel? Shut up. We have a dozen more houses to search after this one, and I'm already tired of your whiny little voice. <clears throat> so shut up.
command. Foxtrot 04. I have retrieved the item. Copy that. I have an instruction team en route to your location right now. Stay there until they arrive. Get Tamara on the line right now. Rachel, you gotta come see this. Holy crap! Do you know what this is? This is Candyman's mirror. You know, Candyman, the urban legend. Yeah, I know who Candyman is. Now let's get out of here. Do you want to see if it really works? What works? The legend of Candyman and his mirror. You know, you say his name five times. No, I got the box. You got the, the puzzle box? I want to see it. Impressive set of skills. Do you have the box? I do. Hand it over. Slowly. It's here. Good. Get off me! I've got it covered. The puzzle box and Candyman? Impressive, Tamara. I may have underestimated you. What about the girl? She is of no use to me. Understood. We'll be en route shortly. You think you're so clever, but we've been on to you. Miss Rachel Cole Al. Why don't you take things off? I will see what you're really made of. You're not my type. Take her to compound 427. Find out what she knows, then kill her. I'm not in the business of torturing and killing my own. Contractors. <laughs> Torture her. Find out what she knows, and then kill her. And then kill yourself. Understood? Yes. Oh. 
you can't kill magic. What's the situation? Dr. Brendel was able to complete his teleportation device to bring Jason and Freddy back, with a few minor issues. Um, Such as? Well, we recovered Freddy's glove. We should be able to pull some DNA from it. And Jason? Jason is here, technically. It's just that he was teleported to another location nearby accidentally. Um, we have a team tracing him by satellite under surveillance right now. I, I can have another team recover. No. I'll take care of it. Prep the new DNA for transfusion. I want my army of nemesis soldiers sooner rather than later. Uh, yes, sir. Um, oh, one more thing. Um, it also seems that Ash Williams was teleported back, but uh, uh, all we have left of him is some goop. I don't care about Ash Williams. Dispose of it. Yes, sir. Go for camera. Change of plans. Jason was teleported back, but is off the reservation. Sending you the info now. Got it. Looks like he's headed towards the old cabin. We're about 15 minutes out. Let Michael take care of this one. I need you back here with the puzzle box in Candyman's blood. <laughs> Yes, Mr. Wesker. The puzzle box is en route, Dr. Quinzel. I know I don't need to stress the importance of the key. Understood. However, we've been making progress with the subject. It just takes time when you have to reintroduce a scenario. I don't care how you get it done. Just do it. You know what's at stake. I see you're a tough girl, and I can respect that. But let me assure you, it's not worth it. Sooner or later, we're gonna find out what we want to know.
We have a visual? Roger, we're up and running. Mars is approaching the cabin. The target's out back. Put it up on the big screen. Good. Get a tactical team en route with some scientists to clean up the mess, and be sure to collect any samples needed. Copy that. Bravo team. Ready your troops and stand by for mission briefing. Mr. Lecter, I'm Dr. Harleen Quinzel, 
May I speak with you? You're from Arkham, aren't you? Yes, I am. May I see your credentials? Certainly. Closer, please. Closer. This was issued last week. You must be one of the new doctors we've been hearing about. I'm in training. I've been going around and meeting all of the inmates. I've been going around and meeting all of the patients. They're still recruiting at Arkham, huh? They must be desperate. We're not all that bad. Maybe after we speak here today, you'll let me know if you think I'm qualified enough to be here. Hmm. That's rather slippery of you. Sit, please. How have the inmates or patients been receiving you? They've been fair, more or less. How are your accommodations? Cozy. And the view, well, you know the view, it's quite dark. Well, I was hoping to get your view on the Lamontian oh, spots. Oh, no, no, no. You were doing just fine. You were courteous and receptive to courtesy. You were building trust with a patient. And now this ham-handed segue into a puzzle box. No, it won't do. I'm only asking because you know how to open it, Doctor, and we need to open that puzzle box. Hell is in the box. Tell me, Dr. Quinzel, what could you possibly want from inside hell? A means to an end. Oh, Dr. Quinzel, you think you can just waltz in here and dissect any bits of information from me? I'm only asking because I thought that your knowledge would benefit. You're what so ambitious, aren't you? You know what you look like to me with that white coat and cheap shoes? You look like a rube, a well-scrubbed, hustling rube with little taste. Good nutrition that's giving you length of bone. Oh, and you're no more than one generation away from poor white trash. Right, Dr. Quizelle? Oh, how quickly the boys have found you with the tedious, sticky fumblings in the back seat of the cars. You can only dream of getting out, getting away, getting anywhere, getting all the way up to the Umbrella Corporation. You see a lot, don't you, Doctor? I wonder if you're strong enough to take that high-powered perception and turn it back on yourself. If you were to look inside yourself and write it down, what would you see? Or are you too afraid? A census taker tried to test me once. I ate his liver with fava beans and a nice Chianti. <laughs> oh, fly back to Arkham, little Quinzel. Fly, fly, fly. Fly, fly, fly. <laughs> What the heck was that? Looks like there's someone in there with him. That's impossible. Dream, you brought him here? It's in my head? No. No, I have no idea what he's doing here. You brought him here, Dr. Quinzel. No, Wesker has my family. Listen, I need your help. Please, I have to open that box. He's gonna kill them. You want it, Doctor? You've got it. You should know how to treat a lady. You should get a better one-liner. I thought you were one-liner. Right here! Looks like you're missing something. Bill, still a little weak. I'll have to change that. Whoa, check this out. There's a huge spike in neurokinetic activity. We gotta get her out of there. I'm trying. She's not waking up. Special work to do, you and I. You've got the 
body. I've got the brain. <gasps> but first, we're gonna have some fun, my little puppy. She's flatlined, ready to defibrillate. John. Mark, is that you? Oh, are you okay? Please help me, Mark. Get him out of my oh, head. Get him out of my head. What, what happened? Please, please help, help, me. help me. Make him, make him stop. Slow down. Please get him out of my head. My head. Here. I can hear you. I can hear you. There's an explosion and my team searching the area. So far, neither Jason or Michael have been located. I see. Sir, we found Michael's knife. We believe it has Jason's blood on it. We're gonna send it to the lab to be analyzed. Excellent. Anything else? No, sir. Bravo team out. One the merchant's box as promised. Very well done, Tamara. Tell me, is Michael still under your control? No. Um, the spell was broken during the explosion. That's disheartening. <clears throat> On second thought, I already have their DNA, so they're no use to me anymore. What about me? Can I go? Dr. Quinzel. Dr. Quinzel is no longer here. Freddy Krueger. That's right, asshole. <laughs> Your pretty little doc is MIA. Hey there, hot stuff. That's a nice box you got there. You know, give me one good reason why I shouldn't lock that facility down and neutralize everything inside. For starters, somewhere in this pretty head is the key to unlocking that box. And also, I've got your buddy, Dr. Herbert West. I'm listening. Good. Because if you ever want your precious serum or a booty call from Pinhead, come meet me at the facility. Bring the box. You know, I could just slit your throat and feed you to all of the animals in here. I'm sure they're hungry. <laughs> no! I've got more important plans for you. How about a little nitric oxide to get this party started? Thank you. 
If you wanted the key, all you had to do was ask. Frank? Is that you? Where are we? How long have I been out? We're safe. Only a couple days. Give me the key. Please. But first, you tell me what you were doing with the Umbrella Corp. Uh, what do you care, Frank? You told me you didn't want to help. Yeah, well, that was then. This is now. Plus, there's a nice little PB&J in it for you. I infiltrated Umbrella's contractor unit in hopes of eventually getting inside the facility. Closer to Wesker. Albert Wesker? No, Bob Wesker. Of course, Albert Wesker. The one who had a hand in killing your family and mine. Where are my pants? I thought Wesker was dead. No, he's very much alive, and I found him. What's your next move? Well, I found the puzzle box on one of my last search missions. I thought that would be my ticket inside, but it turns out they had me pegged from the get-go. So, now I go with plan B. What's your plan B? You know what plan B is, Frank. Now give me a key, and get the hell out of my way. Suit up. We leave in 20. Hey, Frankie. One for old time's sake. This is Umbrella Corp's headquarters in the middle of the city. It's the main entrance to the hive, which is where they do all their nasty experiments. What's security look like? Tight which is why we're gonna go in an old service entrance currently not being used. You sure that'll lead us down to the hive? Yep. We just gotta turn the power on. And kill some zombies. Let's load up. to be a surprise. Frank, you're such a baby. expect to see you here. Peyton? Is that you? What happened to you? I feel great, Frank. In fact, I don't feel anything at all. Well, I'm not here for you, so step aside. I can't do that, Frank. Stop right there. Are you gonna shoot an unarmed guy? What have they done to you? I'm no longer Peyton. I'm everyone and no one. Everywhere, nowhere. Call me Dark Man. It's your last chance to walk away, Peyton. My name is Dark Man.
last chance. Now that's one hell of a boob job. Should listen the first time. I really hate repeating myself. Good. You don't look so good. I'm good, Frank. I've got five hours. Let's use them. Let's do this. One, two, Freddy's coming for you. Three, four, better lock your door. Enough. Five, six, grab your crucifix. Dr. Quinzel, can you hear me? Seven, eight, gonna stay up late. Dr. Quinzel. No, Toll, it's me. Freddy, so it is you. In the flesh, well, almost. Do you like what I've done with the place? Cute. Where's Dr. West and the serum? All business and no pleasure. And the serum? Oh. You need this? Hand it over. What about what I want? What do you want? I want the box. And? I want the box to kill Pinhead and take control of his Cenobite army and all the souls in hell. That's it? 
This is too easy. You're not my type. That's it? I'm a pretty understanding guy. Nice doing business with you. Oh, one more thing. You better hurry. Time is running out. sample from Pinhead, then destroy the place. Got it. No! I'm coming for you next, Albert Wesker. I'm gonna slice open your stomach, pull out your inner pace by pace. Stay with me, Harley, and I'll spare your life. Just open the box, and I'll make all the pain go away. Open it, yes. I need you to open it. things I am made of, you are nothing but a mere afterthought. Enough. Get rid of him or I will. Back off. This is my fight. Then start something. A feeble attempt by a silly witch. She will make a fine feast for my Cenobites. I have a board for your feast right here, needle dick. Ha 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 
Hey there, horror fans. Filmmaker Trent Duncan here. I hope you enjoyed Icons of Horror 2. We are constantly making new videos, so be sure to subscribe and spread the word so you'll get the latest epic horror battles when they come available.